Good morning from Snowcastle Cats. Welcome to a day in the life of Brittany. Today we're going to focus on our lovely lilac torty girl, Brittany. So it is half past ten in the morning. Brittany's day has just started. She's a late sleeper and she is now, she sleeps in that pram. That's her favourite spot. So, and uh, she is now woken up. She's having a mooch around and she's waiting for her breakfast because she knows, hello Fluffy, that today you're not the star of the show because we're focusing on Brittany, yeah, but we'll, we'll, we'll do you another day, no? Yeah, we're, we're gonna, um, sorry, Fluffy maybe lose my train of my fault. So yeah, she's she has various moods. Some days she's in a really good mood and other days she's not in such a good mood. It depends. Yeah, well, I can usually tell. Most days she's in a good mood, but every now and again she's just a little bit off, a little bit grumpy. Okay, so it's 10.30 in the morning and this is what Brittany is doing. She's mooching. Okay, Fluffy, you want to be part of the show, okay? Okay, well, I hope that Brittany doesn't push in when I'm doing the day in the life of, of uh, Fluffy. How would you feel about that? Okay, so let's see what you're doing a bit later. Okay, it's now uh, 11.45. It's the 21st of November, 2020. Brittany's been mooching around downstairs and she's now ready for her breakfast. The other cats will join, but as I say, this video is all about a day in the life of Brittany. She's with Vanity there, but she's, yeah, she's having a, a nice bit of brunch. We tend to be late risers, so we get the cats up quite late and they have their food late, but then their last meal at night could be quite late as well. A lot of breeders tend to do it the opposite. I think most breeders probably get up early, but we get up late. And anyone that has a kitten from us, and this has been reported to us by previous kitten owners, Anyone that has a kitten from us will realise that our kittens like to sleep late. <laughs> but it takes maybe about three or four days to get them into a new routine. So, Brittany's enjoying her raw food. Is this rabbit, no? Or... Uh, maybe duck. Oh, duck. This is raw duck. So I hope you guys are enjoying a day in the life of Brittany. I'm certainly enjoy enjoying making it. I'm going to enjoy looking back on this as well. So I think most cats, probably every cat, likes to have their routine. And our cats are certainly in a routine that suits our lifestyle and, and suits them as well. They're all very happy. Are you enjoying your day, Brittany? Is it going to be another good day? Well, it started off well. So it's quarter past one in the afternoon and Brittany's relaxing on the dining room table. It's a bit messy because we like to relax here with our laptops and our iPads and things. And Brittany just loves being around humans. This is a, ha a happy time. She's a very affectionate cat. This is all part of her fun, I won't say action-packed day, but relaxing day, it certainly is. So this is the part of the day where she just chills out with the humans. It's now 2.30 in the afternoon and Brittany is in a very happy mood. Listen to her purring. She's a big, big purrer. That little when she arched her body, that means she wants me to strike her. 
that's the way she encourages me to come forward and stroke her. She just like moves herself like that. Oh, Brittany, <gasps> such a nice girl. She really is a lovely cat. <gasps> oh, if you could feel how soft she is, you'd be amazed. <gasps> oh, Brittany. Look at the reflection there as well. Double Britney's, look at the reflection. Look at those eyes. Ah. You having a good day, Britney? This is a typical day, isn't it? You do this sort of thing every day, but everyone's getting to see it now. What you really do all day. Your lifestyle. Cat lifestyle. Let's trim Britney's nails now. It's 4.30 in the afternoon and Britney is having her nails trimmed. Okay? So I gently but firmly support her and hold her and knew it trims because she's got better eyesight than me and she's more confident to do it. If, oh. we, if we not trim, she gonna do on us yeah. and on a carpet. Yeah, if we don't trim her nails, as she jumps around, like if I pick pick her up and carry her, sometimes she pushes away as, I, as I'm nearly ready to place her down, she pushes away with her back legs. If she's got sharp nails, that can cut my arms open very easily. So we think it's good to keep the nails trimmed. So we do two times yeah. a month. A couple of times a month, and it just happens to have fallen on this day, which maybe makes it a bit more of an interesting day in the life of Brittany. Good girl. <laughs> Good girl. Good girl. Yes. Hmm. Well done. All done. It's quarter past five. And Brittany is just moving in with the other cats for some tuna. Look at the difference in size. Look at the how gigantic she is compared to the Lucky there. So Vanity's on the left, Lucky's on the right, and Brittany is there tucking in. Yum yum. So she had some raw duck for breakfast and now she's having some tuna. Fluff is watching. Fluff is assumed to position in the box, the empty box. All eyes on Brittany. <laughs> Of today's show. It's now half past eight in the evening and Brittany's having a little game but she's not really interested. <laughs> she was. She was because she came here herself to yeah. play. 
I think she's looking at the other cats. Look, Lucky's come over. Lucky wants to join. Oh, oh. This is the way how she exercises. Only one. Um, yeah, she needs some exercise, definitely. Only one arm to exercise. Put up above her head and see if she reaches up for any. <laughs> I think she's had enough, don't <laughs> Hi guys, it's 10.30 in the evening now and uh, there's some more food here for Lucky but uh, Brittany's decided she wants to join in for a bit of a snack before bedtime. So after this, we'll be putting the cats to bed. And we'll do it all again tomorrow. Well, I think uh, Brittany will be ready to go to bed in a minute. Okay, I'll show you what I do. The sign that I do, I clap my hands and watch her what she does. She knows it's bedtime. She sees that, she'll go upstairs. She knows, when I clap my hands, she knows it means bedtime. So she'll go up to the room. Crap. Go upstairs, follow Crap. up. Crap. Oh, you have to clap. <laughs> go on. So it's the clap, hand clap, and Brittany knows it's time for bed. Come to eat me food there. So this is the end of a fun day in the life of Brittany, the lilac towards you cat. Louis now clapping because uh, Kim. So what we do, we just clap our hands, the cat's know. No, she's coming back out, clap. No, she's coming back out, clap. <laughs> okay. Come on, bedtime, sleep. Sometimes they come and put themselves to bed. Okay, guys. Brittany, good night. I'll just put her into her little bed. You're gonna curl up there a bit, call it a day. Good night. See you guys. Bye. From Snow Castle Cats, good night. See you tomorrow.